dropouts the same guy who dropped out of the th- in the third year of of an engineering college yes. and and uh, my did your dad still say beta degree le le i'm getting a degree by the way <gasps> yeah my my college called me is is calling me and they're so, so you gave your so final much. exams right no i i dropped uh, i dropped out in the third year how come you getting a degree uh, it's a doctorate degree not an engineering <laughs> okay but you're getting a degree Absolutely. so dad's going to be like yay finally I'm like the Hishi would say that you know at subah maine nikla aur bahut acha kar raha hai aur akhbar mein aaye the aur uncle ne bhi bola gupta uncle ne lekin ab degree le le the who was in that company is doing well everybody is talking about it but degree le le just for my dad very indian of our parents yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah completely yeah, yeah. he thinks that i won't get married if i don't have a degree so sweet huh? yes please tell him that i can right so father thinks he'll not get married if he doesn't get a degree i don't know how many girls are here to prove that wrong but please mention that in the comments please do prove that wrong yeah i, I don't I want to study for another year please do that yeah, yeah. but you are getting a degree now so yeah. that battle is won a yeah. doctor now yeah. yeah there are different ways of investigation of the truth one of which and very precise is science and another thing that could come very handy uh, is faith so both can go along each other and i'm so glad that uh, as far as i'm concerned uh, there are different ways that i like the truth one of which is faith and the other is science is my equation with the work if you don't give me films i'll work in tv if you don't give me tv series i'll work in theater or if you don't give me that i'll do nuk- nukkar natak but i'll still act because i love acting just like that when when we say that when i say that he is my brother and i smile and i mean it i we know that he's not my brother yes but when i say he's my brother it actually i'm saying that just like we thought brothers would be he is more of a brother that's what i say right yeah so again it's again uh, cryptic now what is a brother a brother is somebody who would completely possibly understand you before you do and would <laughs> tell you that you know what you should do this yeah. <laughs> you know? yeah so that's big brother now here we are punctuating a very important point understanding filmmaker and an actor A filmmaker could be a great filmmaker and an actor could be an any actor but I think as a team and I think that's what they function as if you just take sure. filmmakers and actors in a context they are the best when they are resonating at the same frequency and when I say at the same frequency I I'm not saying that they are thinking the same thing at the same time I'm saying they think similarly most of the times mm. and they both know it and that is why I say that he's not my brother he's my brother so we all know it so we are not judging each other we have already assumed that there's a hell lot of things that are similar and hence we are making a film now we both are just working together to see gauge feel what is the next shot that we should do which will actually entail everything that we want when the when the writer was writing you know that much that scene so this is what we are thinking not oh do you, oh you know it oh let me appreciate you or how did you know oh, this is so surprising of course this would come and emergent but we're not wasting time here you know we are going out and partying later <laughs> you know what i'm saying but when we are here it actually it is it functions as as a very very efficient uh marker brotherhood mm. we are not judging each other all our attention and this time too is uh to what we are supposed to do that's filmmaking and acting so that's great well said uh maine ek bahut achhi cheez thi ki apne dad se jo ekdam se mere dimag mein aati hai although usme bahut hi precisely answer dunga bahut kuch maine apni mother se seekha hai lekin bahut kuch seekh sakte hain ye apne papa se seekha hai kya baat hai in physics we are told that this is the first law this is the second law in mathematics this is the right answer so we are obsessed with uh thinking that there is a simple one answer to probably complicated questions but what i've understood in the process of doing what i do is that they there are no right answers there are only ways of seeing and it might not be the it, my way of seeing could not be your way of seeing but that's fine we should be okay with this difference of looking at the same thing differently and then probably collaborate and exp- you know many people who've been absolutely you know that they, they saw you on tv and they said okay this this boy has- we're talking to everybody no matter which city you're from no matter what your personal circumstances are but if you have the ability to dream and somehow logically illogically if you can convince yourself that it's going to happen it's just a matter of time what is your definition of love and what is your ideal woman Love is I think resonance I mean like finding different ways in a relationship and continuously finally finding different ways to connect and I think this is what we are doing right now so this is love 
when I was studying, I was like, okay, I just need to remember the laws. I just need to remember the formulas. And when they ask me, it's very simple. It's like they take a test on just two things. One is my comprehension. Two, how much I can retain. And three, in a stipulated time, how much information I can come up with and make, try to make sense. It's, th these things are very simple things. But when you're actually there and you're doing something like uh, uh, performing arts, what you find that, okay, now you're in top 1%. Now those things are not the differentiators. Uh, so that's what I understood that, okay, there are these many parameters that are out there in my hand. And then I became okay with that fact. You know, there are two things and uh, those two things are very different things. And it's my uh, subjective opinion. I might be wrong. One is not knowing because of ignorance or anything. But not knowing is way different from knowing many things to understand that you don't know anything. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I'm here. I have, uh, I have, uh, uh, with all my passion, all my integrity, all my love for what I do, I have understood that all the takes in which I'm very good at, I don't know what I do. So all my research preparation has to do with probably uh, what not to do, but I don't know what to do. And that is the reason why I do it, because what's the point if I know it and then do it? Uh, so I'm okay with not knowing, I'm okay with the failure. But at the same time, what it does is absolutely grounds me. And I'm not thinking about earning a certain reputation. I'm not thinking about what you're thinking about me. I'm just intrigued by the process itself because I don't know what's the next step and I want to know. And I might stumble, I might fall, but I'm okay with that as long as uh, uh, I cannot anticipate. All I'm trying to say is to highlight contradiction. We can only talk till the time one is not agreeing with the other one. Because then there is no communication, then there's nodding. We know that, you know, this happens. So then there is no communication. Communication only happens when there is a disagreement. So we need to disagree. Let's talk about it. Hi, this is Sushant Singh Rajput and if and please do like this video and subscribe to Film Companion. actually quoting Daniel Kahneman, who's the Nobel Prize winner, and he says that there are two different selves. One is the experiencing self, and the second is uh, uh, one who, who just reflects and uh, thinks that I should be happy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so 99% is the experiencing self who doesn't care what is happening, as long as it's fresh. It's a new experience. And that 1% which forms the narrative is completely different and uh, you can manipulate that and uh, I understood that so I, I'm not concerned about that one percent I'm manipul con continuously manipulating that one percent so that I have a good story to tell <laughs> uh, they say that your, sto your life is the story that you tell yourself uh, so I have a very good story to tell but I'm not concerned with that one percent but I'm continuously trying my best to, to, experience. to, to indulge in experience uh, that I absolutely fascinated about so let's move to your film, sir.
when you're in a very comfortable state, when, when you're successful, how do you walk away from success to pursue something that you think will satisfy you? It's a very simple thing. You just need to stop and reflect what you're doing. That's it. Normally what happens is after, <coughs> after such a strong momentum and conditioning, when we get what we want, we somehow find a way to fool ourselves that this is what we want for the rest of our, uh, of our lives. But it's not the case. Uh, if I don't know how to go about my next project, that keeps me excited. Uh, excited. Uh, like I'll, I'll give you an example. Uh, the film that I was supposed to do in November got pushed because of some reason. And I had three months of uh, uh, free time. Uh, I think Feb is, the uh, Feb is the time when my next film is starting. Uh -huh. Huh. So there were three months of free time in between. I, and there are like many film offers in between. So I could have gone for one of them. But nothing excited me. Uh, so I'm doing a play right now. So what I want to say at this point of time is, it's, it's not that I'm doing it to prove a point to somebody else that I'm different. Um, because if you do that and you become successful in doing that, you'll have to put up with a stranger all your life. <laughs> <laughs> so that is not what I'm trying to prove. It is just that, that that's something uh, that, that get, gets me up 10 minutes early in the morning in a way excited way. I don't know how to go about it, but, but uh, I want to get it, get there. So it's, it's the same thing that I have followed since last 12 years. Uh, probably the same thing that happened in TV too. Justice! 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 Justice!